We're moving him back to ICU. All we can do now is wait and hope for the best. I'll post a uniform outside his door. Good, because losing stand back once is too much, you know. I'll post a uniform outside the elevators as well. Excuse me. John. Yes. How's he doing? Well, Dr. Michaels is evaluating him right now. I think he's in good hands. Okay, Hal, I'm going to ask you a few questions. I want you to try to answer simply, if you can. If not, we'll just move on. Okay? Do my best. Whenever you're ready. So, uh, do you remember what day it is? Next. The month? March. Good. Good. Can you tell me where we are right at this moment? Hospital. The name? Next. Do you have a family, Hal? Yes. Children? Yes. Can you tell me their names? Not right now. How about their ages? Uh, boys, girls, teenagers, babies? I used to know this. I used to, when Barbara showed me pictures, you don't have pictures, do you? It's all right. I get the feeling that you love them very much. It's love. Protect. You must protect James. Emily, too. You can't do this to me. I won't let Hal. you. Hal, what do you see? Oh, they won't stop. About? The pounding, the pounding. Well, don't put any don't. pressure on yourself. I want you no, to. No, stop. Stop. Leave me alone. Stay away. Just Stay life. away. Just to Stay away. Leave me alone. Is she all right? Not at the moment. No sedating? Lorazepam, I think. I'll be right back. Hal, I know. I know that this is very difficult for you, and we're not going to have any more questions, okay? Just protect. Protect. Would you like to lie down? Children. Sure Come on. Lie, lie down? down? Yes. Yeah. Good. Quiet. Quiet. Good. Just lie down. Protect the children. Protect. Oh, my God. What has James done to you? Now, where are you going? Out. Why? I have to help James. No, James is not in any danger. Don't hurt him. James I must is in James. the hospital. He has 24-hour care. Don't trust James at all costs. You don't need I to must worry about James, James at all costs. Cost. Don't trust anyone. I must protect James. James at all costs. He's in and out, John. No, I want to give you an example. Stay away. It'll be Stay good. away. Believe I must protect James, James at all. You shouldn't be in here. You're not leaving him like this. Can we please not make this about you? I realize how difficult it must be. This to is not about me, remember? Maybe I was out of line, Maybe. Barbara. But... You accuse me of using Hell's condition to worm my way back into his life. Barbara, I'm sorry. I did it out of being protective. I know this is hard on you, too. Yeah, Hell's always the guy you go to for good advice. He's always the one who can think clearly in any situation. Hell is indestructible. He's gonna be okay. We just have to keep believing that, Marco. How is he? Well, we just gave him a sedative, and when it kicks in, he should be okay for the next couple of hours. Well, then, then what? How do you treat someone in that condition? Unfortunately, Hal's condition is outside of my area of expertise. I'm gonna have to consult with a specialist, someone in thought reform. Thought reform? What is that? Reversing the effects of brainwashing. Yeah, I thought it was something like that. Do you think that there could have been any torture involved? Possibly. Possibly drugs. I can't say for sure, but I will do everything in my power to help him. I can tell you that. May I see him, Joe? Me too. I want you to be very careful what you say to him. The least thing will set him off. Buddy, 
I got kind of a confession to make. Um, I'm really not a very good administrator, you know. I'm, I never know where anybody is at any time, and I always yell at the wrong people. And let's face it, nobody wears the mantle of chief quite like you. And I need you to come back. Okay. I mean, that's not pressure or anything. You take as long as you need. You know, rest, relax, and um, I'll catch up to you later. They admitted Hal into the psychiatric ward. Yeah, how's he doing? Well, Dr. Michael said he's been brainwashed, so she's bringing in a specialist in thought reform. It's what they used to call deprogramming. Let's pray it works. Yeah, well, we can only wait and see. What's going on here? You don't look so good. I got a call from Carly. Oh, that's wonderful. Did she say where she was? No. Did you get a trace? We went on long enough, which is why I'm flying to Europe tonight. Europe? Well, that's a big place. I'll start at the graveyard. In Brussels, the one where, where the spa is dumping bodies. I'll wait for the next delivery. Uh -huh. You're going to make me say this, aren't you? Don't bother. I'm going. Jack, Abigail Williams' trial is coming up. Hell is out of commission. I don't know when no, he's going to... I'm, I'm trying real hard not to be rude here, okay? But I'm not even listening to you. To All right, you. listen to me. The, the, the authorities in Brussels are on this case. If there's a break, they'll handle it. Then you can jump on a plane. No, there, I am not okay? waiting another minute longer. Not for one more person, not for one more case. Carly needs me now. Jack, do you want to at least tell me what you said? In a word? Goodbye. What? She thinks she's gonna die, Margo. She wanted to speak to me one last time. Wait a minute, are you sure about that? You, in her words? When it's all over, try to remember the good times and do your best to forget everything else. I can't let her fade on me like that, Margo, not without a fight. All right, then you better hurry. Might be faster if I take a cruiser to the airport. Detective Snyder needs a cruiser out front now. Go. Go. 